Hello everyone, I'm Avinash and I'm back again with an amazing resource for the people who are going to contribute in Hacktoberfest. In today's video, I'm going to share some beginners friendly repos where you can contribute. People are contributing in my repos. I'm creating an issue, assigning to them and they are making pull requests and I'm accepting. If you are also confused, you don't know from where to start. I'm going to share all my repos where you can contribute. For any doubt, you can let me know in the comment section. Before starting the video, if you are new to this channel, do subscribe and turn on the bell icon because you'll get all the latest hiring and contest updates which I have previously shared. You can apply for those. Here I have uh, shared how you can register for Hacktoberfest and how you can find beginners friendly repos as well. Okay, in this blog I will add more beginners friendly repos. Okay, so yeah. First of all, if you people who are new to open source, basically uh, Hacktoberfest is a one month long uh, open source program where you contribute and get goodies. So if you make six uh, approved eligible PRs, you will get the t-shirt only if you are under 10,000 people. So go and contribute now if you haven't started. Okay, so this is like a, a about the open source why you should contribute and all those things you already know why to contribute open source you learn real world code bases port view build, building networking giving back whatever you have knowledge hacked over facebook like you get goodies t-shirt recognition and many more so this is basic setup that you can do like set up your git and github install git and connect your git with your github uh, account you can watch tutorial regarding that you will easily get on YouTube then learn git and git bases like basic command git clone git uh, add space file which adds all the files then commit so you should know basic commands people who want to do a uh, contribution through code you should know this how to find beginners friendly repositories so the easiest way whenever you open any repository you will get the labels labels like uh, will be added for example here you will get all the labels whether it's a uh, beginners friendly or not all these are labels hacktober face label is added in this repo so means this is hacktober face this repo is contributing participating in hacktober face okay so these are the labels and here are some curated website from where you can get beginners friendly repos okay these are the criteria for beginners friendly and as a beginner how you can contribute you can fix the readme you can add new resources tutorial books or many more things improve styling responsiveness in front end apps add small features like dark mode toggle re refactor of function into cleaner code means these are the basics uh, beginners friendly contribution you can do by improving the readme file documenting it and doing some small changes in front end i'm gonna show so these are my repos like i have listed all these beginner friendly repos where are people are contributing like in a stopwatch so people are making uh, issues and creating pull request and then uh, accepting user input and click make timer so these are beginners friendly repos where you will get all the beginner friendly repo weather app my gallery memory game free programming bigs so i will add this repository where i have listed all my beginners friendly repo and here you can add more beginners friendly repos of yours or anyone else like people are adding these are the some different tech stack uh, repositories where you can get easily beginners friendly repos so if you want to contribute just go any repo and create an issue and uh, ask that you want to contribute i will assign you and then you can start contributing to contribute you just have to fork you will get the button here to fork uh, this repository and then you can start and make a pull request okay and i'll accept if you have any doubt i am here to help you join the uh, hacktober face whatsapp group where you can ask all your doubts thank you for watching the video bye bye